Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Daniel Rosso here. I thought I'd do a video today on the Israeli website called Zap. It's a price comparison website and uh, this is part of my YouTube playlist called Living in Israel, intended for people like my uh, wife's relative who have just moved to Israel and I'm just, you know, kind of gradually bleeding out all the knowledge I've picked up over seven years living here, which becomes second nature, but for newcomers, it's a whole new world. So. Uh, that's why I put up, put up these videos on YouTube. So Zap is a, is a price comparison website. The URL is zap.co.il, but you'll hear it referred to just commonly as Zap. And uh, what it does is basically, if you're looking to buy something in Israel uh, from the internet, in other words, e-commerce, uh, you can either go to a trusted source like KSP, Ivory, Azrieli, or you can shop around using a price comparison engine just like you might use Skyscanner to look at uh, airplane flares, fares, <laughs> except it will be limited to Hebrew. So what you, the way to use Zap is sometimes you're searching for a product and you'll get a Zap link. Otherwise you can go to Zap and put in a product category. Now I chose Seer, Seer, I'm not getting my Hebrew quite perfect today. Seer Orez is a rice cooker. And if you search for it, you will get products. Here's a product listing for rice cookers. Now what I want to show you guys, like any Israeli website, this looks like it was built in the 1990s and is chock full of pop-ups and other unwanted advertising. There's a couple of listing types. One is to buy it. So I presume Zap is making some kind of an affiliate uh, deal with the e-commerce stores. So sometimes this says in Hebrew, which means to purchase. So if I click on this, it's going to take me straight to this vendor and this product page, uh, Bali Buy, I've no idea what this actually is for 195 shackles. Um, <clears throat> but the main use of uh, Zap would be to get price comparison. And that's this blue button. It's called Hashva'at Michirim. So a uh, comparison of prices. So if I click on, let's take this Hyundai blah, blah, blah rice cooker. It ranges in price from 142 to 214 shackles. Now, the value of Zap is in terms of unearthing the long tail of Israeli e-commerce outlets, right? In other words, everyone's heard of KSP and Ivory, but there's a bunch of kind of mom and pop shops around the place that uh, you'll kind of dredge up using Zap, right? So now that I've clicked on this product, this Hyundai rice cooker, I have a bunch of different options. I have, uh, you know, um, and it's sorted from, from most expensive to cheapest. So if you look at Ivory, they're selling this for 188 shekels. Shoe for sale for 179. And I can find it for as cheap as 142 shekels. They also have, besides the price, the Mishloach, which means um, delivery price. So this is free delivery. And uh, Zman Aspaka is uh, delivery time. So this is five day delivery, right? So all this information is populated in the system. Another really useful thing um, would be, so let's say you've never heard of these places like uh, this particular shop here, right? And you're like, oh, I don't know, do I really trust them? So they do have a rating system, both on a per store basis on a, and on a per product basis. So if you look at this, Dobi, Dobi Atar Kniot, Dobi.co.il, and you can read people's reviews. Again, this is a Hebrew website. There's no English translation here. Um, but uh, you can uh, sort through places. And you can also find they've also got reviews for the actual product itself. So by clicking on this button here, I'll get reviews on this actual brand of Hyundai rice cooker as opposed to on the store. I think it's usually more useful. I usually get my reviews from non-Israeli sources, but I generally will, if I haven't heard of a shop, I will uh, check out the profile and see what people are saying about it. So just to be clear, Zap isn't a store. Zap doesn't sell stuff. Zap is a, uh, to the best of what I can see, a kind of scraping tool that aggregates the Israeli e-commerce system and makes it easy for consumers to find new places to buy from. And there's a bunch of little details I'm leaving out here, but that's the gist of it, basically. Um, in addition to being able to type, you can also use a system like this and sort by, uh, you know, um, uh, you know, sort through sort of a, li a list of stuff you might need, uh, like for example, headphones or televisions, and you'll get a much, much bigger selection. Uh, but if you click into any product you're looking to buy in Israel, the Apple AirPods 2, 
Again, you're gonna get this price comparison showing you how much it is in shoe for sale. Look, it's a bit cheaper in these phone stores and maybe if it's free delivery and maybe if it's quick enough, you'll be able to save uh, a little bit of money on your next purchase. Hope this quick overview is useful. If you've never heard of Zap or you have heard of Zap but you're not sure what it is, definitely a useful tool in the arsenal of anyone living in Israel. And the URL one last time is zap, zap.co.il. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.